everyone, I'm Kirsty, and today I'm going to be watching episode 2 of Reborn Rich. I apologise because I have a sore throat today, so I sound like a... I don't even know, I sound very strange, but yeah. And in our last episode, we kind of got to know the lay of the land with, uh, I think his name's Yoon, the main character, his surname is Yoon, family name, um, and how he was kind of a very dedicated staff member of this ch uh, conglomerate group. Um, and then he found um, money laundering slash embezzlement money um, and reported it. And then he got killed um, for finding that information out. Um, and then he got put back into the body of a child in the family in the 80s, um, which is a very strange concept. And I'm really intrigued to see like how that all works. Um, but yeah. Um, I'm definitely interested to see what's going to be happening in this happening in this drama. I'm wondering like how they're going to play it out. Like, is it all going to be from the past, or are we going to get some like current timeline things? I don't know. I'm just interested to see what's going to happen. Um, but yeah, if you enjoy my reaction, don't forget to hit subscribe. And if you'd like to leave a like or a comment, I'd very much appreciate that. My socials are linked down below, including my Patreon, where you can sign up for me and receive early access to my videos. The way he's just staring open mouthed at who was supposed to be like his granddad or something. <laughs> My God, please say something. This is so awkward. Seems like Granny's quite nice. Dega Dega Dugurogu Imagine your grandson just was like, who am I? So there's a lot of mysteries around this family, like why they divorced, what the accident is. Because these, like... We only saw the parents in the current day and they're divorced. And I think one of them is in entertainment. <laughs> oh, she really doesn't like her. Oh, this is awkward, isn't it? So she's kind of iced out. Mm. Wow, just saying stuff like that out loud. Honestly though, I'm a, like I would much prefer that than people talking behind their back. So she doesn't get on with him either. Do they all just hate each other? I think they must do. Probably because they all want to get favour because they want it to be handed down to them, I suppose. 
아직은 국산은 일지한테 안 된다니까요. 오. 오, that's a bit of a touchy subject. 아버지, 어떻게 하셨어요? 밥알 캐스까지? 순양 호텔에 일식당 있나 있나. 학회야 당연히. 와, 대답이 더 필요하나? So he makes it his business to know everything about his business? 맞나? 그래도 국내 일입니다. 백색 가전 분야에서 국내 일위를 놓친 적은 한 번도 없습니다, 아버지. 국내 일위. 국내 일위. Is this is this kind of inspired by Samsung? 이제 윤기도 다른 애들처럼 주말마다 인사하러 오겠대요. 허락하시면요. 아들들을 얼마나 알토랑 같이 잘 길렀는지 몰라요. <웃음> that kid with the plate. That's so funny. 그래요, 아버지. 이제 그만 노영 푸시고. 영화 그게 돈이 됩니까? 돈보다 더 가치가 있는 순양에는 도움이 됩니까? 아버지. 돈도 안 되고. I mean, movies do make money. 와, 네가 내 아들이고. 회장님. 손님 나간다. 소금 뿌리라. <웃음> Oh my god, what an awful thing to say. Sunyang Group on the Chin Guy Day, some born and killed another. As my Mm. So, I guess Dojun is the car, the the accident. I don't know why I say I said car crash there for a second. I don't even know what the accident was. Who's that? Is that the eldest grandson? The one who was like really horrible in the last episode? <gasps> and that's the vase smashing! Oh my god, okay. 그게 무슨 말이야? 도자기는 이 자식이 깼어요. 이 방에서 회장님 물건 훔치가다 저한테 걸렸거든요. 오. 오 마이 갓 티. What the hell? Ni Marhamadi Hengdong Hana Hanae. She got Shimam and Patrick Willet. Giga, Kuruma Kadok to the Sengbung Judita. Take responsibility. Kang Yang in Kang Yang in Kang Yang in. 순양 그룹의 후계자 잡지 못했기 때문이다. 순양 그룹의 후계자. Can people hear him saying that? That's a bit weird. 내가 살아온 과거의 시간 그대로 난 1987년에 대한민국에 와 있는 거야. Where are you going? 그렇다면 그럼 그러면. My question is, I was going to say like, oh, maybe he is the son.
of them and he's just gone back in his memories. But no, because he must remember his childhood. Oh. Oh, has he gone to see his mother? Is that him? Oh, it's his brother. That's his mum. Oh, that's sad. Is no one seeing this child being creepy outside the window? Oh, he just wants to have his mum's cooking. That's really sweet and sad. He wants to eat. Let him eat. You're not my mother, that woman is. She's so mad at him. Fuck off. You're a parent. They're not investments. Jesus. So that's him. That's interesting. This is such a weird concept. I was thinking maybe it would like be back in his memories and he'd forgotten with amnesia or something that he was actually someone else. But no, he's just straight up in a different body. <laughs> <laughs> He's like, are you someone else in someone's body? Why is he back there? Oh. This is weird to think about because he's a boy, but I know he's also a man, and this is really, this is really disorientating. No, he just is a man in his forties. <laughs> Oh, so she's a daughter. She's not a daughter-in-law. Okay. DJ <laughs> Absolutely. No, you are not. You're saying it for the good of your husband. Where is he getting that money? Oh, that's what he means by paying him back. He's giving them the information to pay him back. 
여기서 어른들 얘기를 엿드는 거냐? 어디서 본바 없이 잘한 티를 내? 너 부모가 널 그렇게 가르쳤어? 자식에게 그런 무례를 가르치는 부모는 없을 겁니다. 할아버지 애정품을 도둑질하라고. <웃음> 단일화에 성공할 수 있을 거라고 보세요. 전 아니라서. 도저히 값은 다 치는 것 같은데요. He has a very similar smile to Song Junki there. That's weird. YS와 DJ 민주화를 위해 헌신해 왔다는 명분으로 여기까지 온 거야. 정치 생명을 건 도박 따윈 하지 않을 거다. Except they will. 시장님, 대선 관련해서 뉴스 속보 같았습니다. 확인하시는 게 좋을 것 같습니다. 무슨 일이에요? 민주당의 김영삼 총재와 김대중 고문은 오늘 합의. 하하하하. 네 하나만 더 대답해 봐라. 도저히 값은 이미 다 치른 것 같은데요, 할아버지. 어려운 거 알다 퀴즈다 정답 맞히면 상금도 있겠네요. 퀴즈니까. He's so brazen. 반대로 이런 속담도 있다. 고래 싸움에 새우 등 터지다. 그러면은 새우가 어부지리로 고래를 이길 방도는 없겠나? No. Well, yes. I'm from the future. I know how it works. 형이 그러던데? <웃음> 형이? 이럴 땐 이렇게 하는 거라고. 척 보면 애입니다. 뭐야 이건? 황기순 씨 유행합니다. 황기... 마! 요런한테 이게... 그럼 앞으로는 기술 장사해야 먹고 산다. 반도체는 우리 순양의 미래 먹거리다. 뭐 반도체가 돈이 되냐? So he just doesn't like the humans have wills and would like to not be overworked. 감사합니다. 정치 보복을 하지 않겠다고 선언하신 고문님의 인품에 저희 회장님께서 깊은 감명을 받으셨습니다. Is he putting his eggs in different baskets? <웃음> 1등하고 2등이 싸워서 3등이 이기는 걸 어부지리라 했다. 그러면 새우가 어부지리로 고래를 이길 방도는 없겠나? I didn't even think about this show having like the political history stuff. I didn't even think about that. Pizza, Chong Dabe. Hey, Moni. Hara was getting my smee, so say. Chicken take a guess here. Paguda the tree jung you. Baghdad? Oh, my goodness. I just noticed a spelling mistake there. It said Yunag instead of Yang. He's insane. Oh my god. <clears throat> So he's on the plane. <웃음> 그렇다면 내가 와서 이곳에 줄새 변화가 생긴 걸까? 내가 너무 늦은 걸까? 내가 좀더 일찍 기억을 되살렸다면 난 진해장을 살릴 수 있었을까? I think there's something more to this. Maybe he wasn't on the plane. Oh. Oh, 
You? We thought you died. That's a bit harsh. Your wife thought you died. <laughs> Did his mass message get to them? Is that the message? Oh, he found it. Okay. He is a bit sus. Hello, yes, I'm from the future. I thought he was going to tell him there. He's his new political advisor. <laughs> He's predicting the recession now. Bundang. <laughs> I had to pause it to read this. Bundang started to be redeveloped in 1989 is now a highly affluent A neighborhood. <laughs> okay. Smart kid. Well, he's not a smart kid. He's a smart older man. In the body of a kid. Like I said, I'm. <laughs> this is really jarring because I know he's a grown adult man in the body of a kid. But all I can see is the kid. Oh. So he's going to work to join the School of Law? Oh, he's bringing them back into the fray. <laughs> She's got faint. I'll be like, what the hell have you done with Grandad? Oh, yeah, someone did her kill him in that family. That's very true. So, who? Oh, are we going through a time jump? Oh. <laughs> I'm sorry, but no. 
<laughs> he does not look like a 20 year old. You can fluff his hair up all you want. That's definitely really an interesting show. I don't. I am very. Oh, I'm very confused by the fact that he was a child and and a man. <laughs> Just like mess with my brain a bit. Um, but yeah, I definitely think it's interesting the way he's managed to get favor with his granddad so quickly, or not his granddad, but Kojun's granddad. Um, I'm imagining the fact that Song Jun Ki is playing him as an adult teenager, like a later teens, early 20s guy, and is more along the lines of like, um, in The Untamed. Um, if anyone's seen The Untamed, Xiao Zhan plays like, um, Wei Wuxian as Wei Wuxian, but he also plays Wei Wuxian when he's in um, Wu Xian Yu's body. Um, and I think like uh, the whole kind of thought thing around that was the audience was supposed to, it was supposed to be so the audience could recognize it as being him, but also like you kind of have to like pretend he looks like someone else. So I feel like, I don't know if that's going to be the case with this where it's like, um, we're seeing Song Jun Ki so we know it's him, but he doesn't actually look like that because that would be very confusing if he looked like that and then there's Yoon who is him and looks like him. <laughs> I feel like that would be very weird. Um, but yeah, it's definitely interesting and like he's doing all that, right? He's gonna try and find out who killed him off in real life or in his normal life. But like, I don't, oh, I'm just gonna be so confused for this whole thing. It's very weird. And also, like, so Dojun is not in any of the records or anything like that. And there was mention of their child being in an accident. So I'm guessing the accident was Dojun. But, like, how is he avoiding this said accident that's made him not exist, essentially? Oh, I've got a lot of questions. Let me know your thoughts down below. And thank you so much for watching. I hope you have a great rest of your day. Goodbye.